Ah, oh, hell yeah, we cleared it. <laughs> oh. So, you're one of the Enclave's patriots. Yeah. And that's a surprise. I didn't really take you for an idiot. Well, nobody does. But then I talk, and it's like, oh, yeah, I get it. Hello! Welcome once again, raiders, traitors, scavers, and everything in between. I'm Follower Toshi, and I guess I'm going to end this this series by fucking up my own goddamn intro. Uh, but welcome back to New California. And it looks like we are at a, at a standoff with Anaya Ran here. She knows we're working with the Enclave, and, uh... Yeah, this'll be fun. And you're just another freak America needs to... Bleh. And you're just another freak America needs eliminated. Great. You're one of them, all right. Let's skip the chatter and go straight to the gunfight. All right, that sounds fun. Hit, hit. Oh, God. No fair. I can't teleport. You shouldn't be able to either. Wait, are we fighting here, or...? Hello? 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 Oh. Ooh. Oh, what if I could get up to there? That'd be cool. Oh well, let's go. Well, no Jerry. Oh, excuse me. Alrighty then. Let's see what we got in here. Hey guys, how's it going? This is actually the part where it makes sense that you don't attack me. Hey Chevy. You've made it. I have to say, your battle with the mutant leader was most impressive. Yeah, I, met, I let my guys do most of the bay. work. He has some final adjustments to make before the weapon is ready to launch. Okay. Also, there is a mercenary coming to make a last attempt to stop the weapon from arming. We'll have to defeat them together. Yeah, I met her already. You mean the thorny glowing chick that tossed a grenade at my feet? Oh, it was a grenade. That makes a lot more sense. Yeah, I, I met her already. Then you know how dangerous she is. We have a personal history with her. She's made a career hounding our footsteps. Mm, I see. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I will kill on the kill her on sight. Don't be so certain. You may have faced down the super mutant father, but she is different. Treat her as though she were the threat of your life. Okay. Report to Colonel Bragg. He'll have further orders regarding your next assignment. Okie dokie. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, God. Help. Defeat an IR ramp. Project reveal. We'll heal her. Yeah, knock her down or some shit. That's not the weapon I wanted. Uh, let's get a weapon that's actually going to work here. Oh. Never mind. She's dead. Uh, stop, stop dancing. All right, that battle is actually a lot easier than I thought it would be. Nice work, soldier. I've seen your handiwork scattered all over the wasteland. You have a death toll that'd make any general proud. Thanks, coach. After this, you're coming back east with us. Ooh. We got one last goal to accomplish, then we're bailing out of here. Let's finish off these two bad guys and launch this missile. Who the bad guys? Uh, who are those guys? Who are these guys, Colonel? They're really hard to... Oh, <laughs> let me rephrase that. Who are these guys, Colonel? They're really hard to kill. Now's not the time for questions. Let's make sure those bodies are in the path of the missile exhaust, then take flight. We bodies? Get back to base, then we'll have time to talk. Sir, yes, sir. Damn right, soldier. Toss their corpses over the end of the missile bay. Make sure they don't get back up. <laughs> we'll light the fires and watch them vaporize from a safe distance. Okay. Uh. Well, there was only one body, so. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how that's gonna quite work out yet, but uh, all right. Oh, okay. I guess Jerry's all of a sudden decided to join the party. Where are you, Jerry? You over there? Oh God, it's Jerry. Get him! Fuck you, Jerry. Ow, Jesus! Jerry, stop shooting me. I thought we were cool, bro. Well, it doesn't matter what you thought now, cause you did taking your mask. What's behind the mask? Oh my god! He was Coach Bragg all along! Oh my god! There she is. Hey, Naya. Oh, jeez, hello. Anaya, I like how you look like Wolverine. There you are. With some effort, you managed to dump Anaya and Jerry into the missile silo. Oh! Hey, we did it. They're, they're in there somewhere. Alright. We did it, coach. Now what? 
Nice work, soldier. Thanks. Now let's get this bird in the air. Punch in the target coordinates for the NCR's military bases. Consider this our parting gift to the California territories. We'll be back one day after we gain a stronghold back east. Mm, mm. Uh, where are we heading, sir? President John Henry Eden revealed himself to Colonel Autumn a few months ago and gave us standing orders. We got the anti-FEV serum from this base after hiding out in Vault 18 for nearly 10 years. It was a long wait, but I knew he'd come through for us. Now we have a new home, Fort Raven Rock. Can't wait to see it. Hell yeah. I don't think the president should be revealing himself to people, but I mean, hey, you know, I, what do I know? I'm not in politics. Uh, do you have any further orders for me? Just get that missile airborne, and we'll see to your future. It's gonna be bright. Every Hell enclave yeah. officer gets a sweet call sign from their first regimental commander, like Chevy, Leonidas, or Tomahawk. Uh -huh. How about we take to calling you Autumn? Colonel Autumn's a friend of mine in the big leagues, and he needs a new captain. You could take up with him. He'll give you the training you need to become a legendary officer. I'm proud of you. Hell yeah. So, uh, am I? Cur no, there's already a colonel. I don't know. Fuck it. Uh, wait. No, New Vegas takes place before Fallout 3. That's right. Uh, let's end this, sir. Damn right. <laughs> let's get out of here. Fire up this bastard and meet me back at the Vertibird. Okay. Let's get out of here. Wait, doesn't it? I want to burn this place to the ground and forget it ever existed. Okay. Do, 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 do. Set the Titan V missile targeting to the NCR base. All right. Oh, that, <laughs> that would have been funny if it gave us the option to target the Enclave. Uh, that would have been... That would have been hilarious. Boop! Ooh, team got a little... Hasta luego, muty scum. So we just get on or quest complete. Destroy Fort Dagger Point. Hell yeah. The battle is over. New California is burning beneath radioactive skies. The NCR will recover in time, but only as they reach ever northward towards Las Vegas and the frontier. They'll destroy cities and tribes with every new land they take, becoming the mirror image of the Empire they pretend not to be. The remaining Raider tribes are forced to flee to Arizona, and a new Empire begins to rise. What remains of their scattered and broken people integrate into Caesar's Legion. In their thirst for glory, they will soon conquer 80 tribes and march onward towards Hoover Dam. With the Fort Dagger Point complex destroyed and the heart of the NCR burning, the Enclave forces that remained behind at the end of the last war in California begin heading east towards the call of their president. As for you, after a long and protracted campaign to conquer Washington, D.C., the monster from Vault 18 runs straight into the rising fist of the Brotherhood of Steel. The Enclave buckles and breaks under their rebellion, and John Henry Eaton is ultimately defeated by a lone wanderer from Vault 101. You alone survive to carry the tale of Project Brazil. Retreating to Chicago, you send out dozens of iBots in search of any surviving Enclave forces across the American wastes. All return silence. But one. In a last attempt at finding the remaining members of your clan, you return to California at a place called Hopeville. Not long after the town begins to prosper, the Fort Dagger Point key you kept with you all those years triggers the self-destruct on the town's arsenal of buried nuclear weapons. Haunted by your past and chased by the NCR, you are forced to find ways to hide your tracks. While searching for another ex-agent, you take a job as a courier. Hot on his trail, you come into possession of a mysterious poker chip. You are tasked with taking the item to New Vegas. But along the way through Good Springs, your bad karma finally catches up with you next to a shallow grave in the desert. You got what 
what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink, dig? You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18-carat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. Cool. I was kind of wondering how um, how it was all gonna, or how the Enclave was going to to integrate all that. Um, I remember that uh, you're awake because I have I have played this that? before, but it did I it been a it been a while, uh, oh, and I didn't easy, remember how the Enclave easy. played out. But that was that was interesting because not only does now. an Why Enclave ending. Integrate not, not only Fallout New well, Vegas, but it great. also draws no, you I through you Fallout mind, 3 as well. Granted, you're your one of the uh, one of the Enclave, and it doesn't seem like you were a very important work, character, because a lot anything, of the actual um, context made it seem more like you were just another soldier uh, there. It didn't mention that you worked for... Uh, for... Uh, for Colonel Autumn or under Autumn specifically, it just says, oh yeah, you were there and you were the only survivor and then uh, you, I already, I already blanked out and missed where he said you went, but you went somewhere, sent out a whole bunch of iBots and then went back to California uh, because you found one and then it integrates back. That I think is kind of cool. Uh, it's, it's very interesting how they did that because the Enclave it doesn't really have like its own storyline like the Raiders or the NCR did, so they kind of integrated it between the two, which makes sense because it's um, uh, you're you're playing espionage and everything. Uh, but it's interesting that that has perhaps the most expansive uh, ending, because like I said, you're not only going through Fallout New Vegas but also Fallout Three, so that's 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 pretty cool. Um, but, uh, yeah, for now, this will be, uh, this will be the end of, uh, <laughs> this is the final episode of Fallout New California. I hope you all have enjoyed this, uh, this wild and crazy ride. Uh, I, I have enjoyed every single second of it. Recording episodes has sometimes been a chore, but, uh, my God, it was, it was great revisiting this mod. It's a fantastic mod. Uh, and I hope that you all enjoy the, the subsequent review that will, uh, that will be coming out, uh, in the next couple of days. Um, <laughs> it's gonna be a doozy. For now, though, I want to thank you all once again so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please do, I know I say it at the end of every single episode, but it really does help out. Uh, hit like, comment, let me know what your favorite part of this whole big adventure was. Tell me your thoughts. I'd love to read them down in the comments. Like the video, comment, share this entire series with somebody if you think they might enjoy it or, you know, you just want to, or they're interested in New California. Uh, share the share the series. Um, always remember to subscribe. Hit the subscribe button. Helps me out a whole lot. And until next time, I will see you all out there in the wasteland.